Hey, blog buddies, it's me, Justin. Hey, bitch, don't introduce yourself. <laughs> hey, no, stay <laughs> down. It's Joe. I'm start the motherfucking off. I'm sick of this. Hey, blog buddies, it's me. I'm Joe. So, we're here, and, um... We're pretty weird, I guess you can say. We just got done playing the Wii. It was pretty fun, um... I'm so jealous right now because Joe got the book called Freak Show. Heard of it or heard of Party Monster or anything like that? But it's the story of um, it's a story about a kid and how he's growing up under being gay and how to be fabulous, basically. <laughs> well, the author of the story is James, none other than the James St. James, Mr. Fabulous, bald. Juicy, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Could be nasty. Anyway, um, so yeah, we're here to talk to you about um, It'll die. <laughs> appreciating your appreciating yourself and um, having more confidence. Um, I don't know. Lately, a lot of people have been down and out about how they feel and about like being self conscious. And I don't know. To me, I've been pretty happy. So yeah, I, I think that what people should do in order to um, feel more confident in themselves is to start pointing out the things that um that they like and then the things that they want to change um don't sit back and just hold yourself back and be sobbing over something that you don't like i mean if you don't like something change it that's how i was i mean i was sick look i have a huge ass nose look at that it's it's disgusting <laughs> anyway um how I accomplished that by getting rid of it. You could do illusions by having long hair. My hair, like, I don't know. I think that's a great way of hiding um, a facial feature, I think. And, um, I mean, everyone has imperfections, and we could change those imperfections. Why do you think they made makeup? Um, what do you think, Joe? I well, mean, Joe hates to, jo like, let's say something with Joe. Joe hates, like, his eyes around here. So he wears glasses. What the hell? Why not? Why not do something that the world made and use them for use them for something rather than just the sun? Um, let's see. And I think that by staring in the mirror and writing something down and saying like what you like will help you because um, you're like wow, wow. I never really realized that. If you sit there for a while, point out your flaws, point out all the things that you like, point out the things that you don't like, and then figure out a way how to flaunt them. I think that's the best way to go. Yeah, and if you're, like, fat or chubby like me, wear a rockin' shirt. Pimp that shit out. Just wear something cool so it takes away from that. Yeah, wear something we, nice. Me and Joe like to call it, instead of calling it chubby fat and having that label, I mean, a label is so wrong, and I, I don't even see how people could label themselves. I mean, how, how are you so low to label yourself and sum it up all into one word? One word. Like, all these kids going around, oh, saying, I'm seen, I'm emo and shit. I mean, come on. Be everything. I mean, why would you want to put yourself down to just one, one label, one word? Come on. You're better than that, people. Yeah. Um, and let's if see. If, 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 <laughs> if, if you go up to someone and someone tells you that you're fat, be like, bitch, I'm voluptuous. I'll kick your ass. <laughs> Yeah. Don't literally say that, but I mean, tell them, <laughs> tell them that you're voluptuous and Just tell you know, them. you're beautiful. I mean, don't tell someone that, uh, you're not, don't tell them that I don't like you. If someone ever asks you out, don't tell them that you don't like them. Tell them that you're just not their type and you're just not what they prefer because that really puts down a person. And how would you feel if someone told you that or something? Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, anyway. So yeah, um, so if you really want to um, boost up your confidence and stuff, or have some type of idea, I know I read a book. It's called Confessions of a what was it? Confessions of a serial killer. It's Confessions of a serial kisser. Kisser. <laughs> serial <laughs> killer. All that. No, Confessions of a serial kisser. It was a really good book. And another one too is uh, Michael. I mean James St. James Freak Show, and that's really good. And we're not gonna get into that story how he got the book, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We'll just say that. Yeah, it's a really good book, so look it up. It teaches you about how what people go through, like, in everyday life. And, yeah. <laughs> yeah, um... Or if you really want to get, like, down to the nitty-gritty... Nitty-gritty... <laughs>
<laughs> Get yourself a spell book. Simple spells for love. Cast these bitches. <laughs> Let's see. You could get these at any bookstore, no? Yeah. You get these, I think, at any Hastings, bookstore. Hastings, 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 Barnes & Noble. Go to the mall. Be like, bitch, I want a spell book. Write it up. Get your credit cards out. Go on to... Go on to... Um, Amazon, eBay. Amazon. Look up Barry Dolnick. Simple Spells for Love. You have some good stuff in there to help you. Inspirations. I mean, you don't have to really cast them. Or do stuff like that. But just read the shit. Anyway. <laughs> um, we're gonna get... We're gonna get back to, like, our business. You know what I mean? I'm just kidding. No, I'm JK, kidding. JK. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna um play the Wii. Yeah. Um, and so don't put yourself down. Just flaunt yourself. Be fabulous. And if somebody labels you, come to school one day. Be like, oh my god, look at emo kid wearing a polo. And be like, motherfucker, I am everything. Don't be jealous. That's exactly what you should say. I mean, um... Feel happy, feel proud about yourself. When you get up and feel tall, walk, walk around like, like if you own the place. I mean, don't act, don't act it, be it. it I mean, it's you, you might hear that a lot, but it's the truth. I mean, and also don't dream it, just be it. Don't dream of being something, just don't be that shit. I mean, I mean, like we're not saying don't have dreams. We're saying have dreams but make them reality then rather than being pessimistic and saying oh I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do this and then not Never do it, it. Yeah. so I don't know if you guys need any any help or anything add us on MySpace and we're here to talk um you'll find our our info on the side somewhere probably over there or over here I'm not sure but probably over there not really sure anyway <laughs> but yeah this be yourself. Be yourself. We love you guys. XOXO. Be fabulous. XOXO. Mm. For sure, maybe. For sure, not. For sure, eh. For sure, bomb. You'll tell that it's up. Lights, you try to the dashboard. Look at the mess we made tonight. Kick up your stomach. Kick up your stomach. And fuck me in the back. Say, fuck me in the back.